we've been waiting for, a sequel to The Devil Wears Prada that's finally in the works. Miranda Priestley is the editor-in-chief of Runway. So you don't read Runway? No. Not to mention a legend. And before today, you've never heard of me? No. You work a year for her, and you can get a job at any magazine you want. And you have no style or sense of fashion. I, I, no, no. That wasn't a question. <laughs> According to Variety, the original film screenwriter is in talks to return. There's no word on any casting, but the storyline reportedly follows Miranda Priestly as she navigates the decline of traditional magazine publishing. Is this really how you see yourself? That witch is gone, leaving you trapped in her distorted spell. Claw your way out. <laughs> The Witch is back. Marvel fans are getting their first look at the trailer for Agatha all along. The new series is a spin-off of WandaVision, focused on Katherine Hahn's character, Agatha Harkness. The first two episodes premiere September 18th on Disney+. Plus. A twister touchdown in London last night, or more accurately, the film Twisters. The sequel to the 1996 summer blockbuster had its premiere last night. It stars Glenn Powell and Daisy Edgar-Jones. Powell says he was stoked to get a chance to do the movie, and then reality set in. Well, you're always excited by the title. It's one of my favorite movies as a kid. Um, but then I think you get on the ground in Oklahoma, and it's, and it's hot, and they're throwing stuff at you, and you're getting dragged across the field. And look who showed up to the premiere, Tom Cruise. He posted this pic of him and Powell saying, fun night with friends, watching a movie. You may recall the two co-starred in Top Gun Maverick. And one of my favorites, Shibuzi's A Bar Song, Tipsy, has hit number one on the Billboard Hot 100. This marks his first number one. The single also recently topped the Hot Country Songs chart making him the second ever black artist to reach the highest slot on both charts. Wow. This song has really taken off. I got to talk to him at CMA Fest, too, and he was so sweet, so wonderful. But you know what's funny is my parents are probably the biggest fan of this song. Oh, really? Yeah, so it's just hitting people of all, of all ages. I love that. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, Brianna. Uh, let's check with Wesley Lopez. Lopez, what are you doing over there? You know, just thinking about the